Tammy Martin, are you out there? I am. Can you hear me? What's up, Tammy? <laughs> How are you, Tammy? Thanks for joining us. I know you joined us on, on short notice because I, I said we ought to just have you on tonight. Um, where are you calling from? I'm in Pasco, Rhode Island. Pasco, Rhode Island. Who shared ER Shred with you? You and Crystal. Okay. Okay. <laughs> and, and we're going to get to something else in a minute here that I think is very cool for everybody to know. Um, <laughs> so with <laughs> thank you for that. With that in mind, um, what is your passion in life? My passion in life is my family and mm. I love traveling. Passion in life is family and traveling. That's fantastic. And, uh, you know, I know Jesse's just itching me for me to ask the question. Jesse, why don't I allow you to say hello to our friend Tammy here? And, you know, maybe we can all just talk amongst each other. Um, what do you know about this gal, Tammy, Jesse? Hi, Tammy. Hi, Jesse. <laughs> ah, I'm so excited you're here. So, for the record, uh, if it wasn't for Tammy Martin, I wouldn't even be standing here today. So Tammy is the person who was brave enough to hound me down and share isogenics with me originally. And Tammy and I worked together a while back uh, in a precious metal refining company. And we were literally like a window apart. So, I mean, the relationship that we got to build, we, we, would, we would have fun. I mean, it's kind of like that, but we would have fun. Uh, it, we always made it fun and entertaining. And, I mean, she knew my puppy. She knew my, my dog Summit since he was a puppy. She knows my, my daughter Kaylee. Um, and when I worked there, you know, again, I've, I've been doing this for a long time. And, um, you know, I didn't think I needed anything, right? Like, I, I, was, I was an athlete. I was jacked. I was shredded. I was this. And Tammy watched me selling supplements out of the back of my trunk like a madman. I mean, thousands of dollars worth. You had me trying them as well. I had to be trying them too. Like, Here's some samples, you know? Uh, I didn't know what I didn't know. Um, this was a while ago. Uh, and she was like, you know, you should really try this. I was like, oh, come on. Like, you, you know what I mean? Like, this is where, you know, I tell the story of my ego getting in the way for a while. Um, you know, she, she Tammy's daughter, um, she, she had to come in. She's a scientist. She had to come in. She tricked me. You know, we had lunch one time and, and they came in and started. She's like, oh, I'm going to get in with the science. I'm going to get in with the science. And eventually that's literally what she did. She saved me from going to another company. She literally saved me from going to another mm -hmm. company. Um, thank God. Right. Like, and um, yeah, I'm just so thankful for you, Tammy. I'm so thankful for you. Our relationship has continued. Um, I'm so excited for you. I'm proud of you. I know your goals. I know what you want. I know what you, what you deserve in life. Uh, man, I am just so excited that you're here. So I love you to death. And I love I you too. You in Orlando. Cause she's traveling oh. to Orlando. Oh, yes. are you coming to Orlando, Tammy? Yes. All right. So Isogenic Celebration 2023 in Orlando, you guys, July, come, come be with us all. Tammy. Yes, definitely. I got to ask you. You know, everybody now knows that you're this badass dragon slayer. Like you slayed the beast. You you slayed the beast. Like we all love Jesse. We all appreciate Jesse. Jesse has shown up, you know, uh, definitely as much as me. And <laughs> and you know, I I can't say that anybody's shown up more than him. I I can't even say that I've shown up more than him. But he's special to us all. We're very grateful for him. Um, he operates from a very sincere, genuine place. And if it wasn't for you, I wouldn't know him. So thank you for that. So I just want to say that I knew Jesse's passion with nutrition and stuff because I watched it every single day. And I listened to him talk to people every day at work pouring sugar on the table saying this is how many tablespoons is in that soda and you know just doing all the visuals and um so I just knew that Isogenics was the company for Jesse and I wanted him to be a part of us our community in Isogenics because I knew what he had to offer but I also knew because of his science background that when he almost went to the other company I got on the phone and I, I called my daughter Tia and I said, Tia, 
you got to get here. You got to come here at lunchtime and you need to come and talk to Jesse. So I had Jesse, but I don't want to say Tia was the icing on the cake. I have to say that Tia was the butter on the beef, <laughs> on the steak, because she Perfect. hooked them. We both got them, but she oh. had to share that science. So, yeah. God, I love how you say butter. I but, uh, like that. <laughs> I like that a lot. Okay, so it doesn't matter what uh, weapon you employed. You you were mm -hmm. smart to have her. You know, you were the one that oh, employed yeah. the, the, the tool there and the resource and the weapon. So you guys, can you, who wants to talk about your ER shred experience, Tammy? What's that all been like? Like what, how did that unfold? So I have been following you and Crystal. I follow, you know, I follow you guys um, since I met you when I fir went to first celebration um, back in Las Vegas. I remember your daughter actually came to dinner with us as well. Yes. Yeah. We were all at dinner together and uh, the two years, actually, I only missed, I don't, did they have it in Salt Lake? They had it, right? Never did. Never did. Okay. Cause I wanted to go and I didn't. The last one was Nashville that mm -hmm. I went to. Um, but I listened to everything and I was like, I wanted to try it because I was always a meat eater. And then I was cutting back on eating beef and stuff because, you know, I was told it wasn't good for me. Mm -hmm. And, but in isogenics from, I've been in isogenics since 2015, I believe it was, mm -hmm. um, when my daughter got me on isogenics and I had been eating pretty clean, like 80, 20. I had lost 30 pounds doing um, the first isobody that I did. Um, and I had just felt great, but, and I thought I was doing good and I'd fluctuate. I'd, you know, be doing good. And then I would kind of go back the old way. But since I've been doing the ER shred, I do the shred. And my biggest thing from my first, shred i had lost eight pounds in that 11 days but i didn't realize how much inflammation i was carrying because mm. i had lost overall 24.75 inches and wow. i went down to pant size and i couldn't believe how inflamed i was even when i had taken my photos i never really actually even seen inflammation in people but now I see it all the time in people. And I have so many family members that I do share the ER shred with. And I only can do what I can do and just hope and pray that one day they'll just keep watching and they'll decide that, you know, I want to try it. Mm. Because there's, I just see so many people. But I have been um, sticking with it. Um, over the holidays, I kind of slacked a little bit, but not... Not so much. I think it's just, for me, inflammation is sugar. And I'm not a big sugar person. But if I did have treats and stuff, I, I do notice the, sh the sugar. And I'm not a big alcohol drinker. But on occasion, if I have a drink, depending on what it is, and it's probably more because the sugar is in the alcohol as well, that I would notice that um, the inflammation, I wouldn't feel as great. Yeah. Um, but other than that, my first 11 day, it was really great because within the four days I did feel like I came alive and that felt great. Mm. And I just kind of felt like a wackadoodle, like just being a crazy person, like, you know, Jesse, you know what I'm talking about. So that was like coming back. So that was like awesome. And, um, you, I got, was your mo you my got your mojo back, right? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and I was sitting at my desk and. I was at the computer at work and then I realized that for the first time in a long time that I actually felt my abs, like I could feel my muscles in my stomach. And I was just like, that was weird to me because yeah. that was just clean eating for four or five days. And then all of a sudden I just felt that and it was great. I just, just felt great. Yeah. And it motivates you to, to keep with it and yeah. motivates you to keep going and do more. And, you know, so it's very gratifying in that way. The body rewards us. Yes. 
that I want. I'm, I mean, I'm on everything. I watch everything. I might not be in the groups at the time. If I don't, if I'm not on the lives, mm -hmm. you guys are in my ears. I got you on at work. That's all I listen to. I listen to, you know, the podcast and, you know, I listen to mm -hmm. your wife. I think she's awesome. I always mm -hmm. listen to Crystal too. Yeah, she is. You guys are awesome. I can't You're wait to see you in Orlando. That's going to be a lot of fun. Yeah, it will be. I can't wait. I really can't wait. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming on. Jesse's going to close us out.